I'm reading this from the World Athletics website. In what will be Germany's first professional spectator sporting event since the corona lockdown, a pole vaulting facility will be set up in the Otto Kino Dusseldorf, where three of the country's leading pole vaulters will compete surrounded by the spectators' cars. Germany's 2013 world champion Raphael Holzdepi, 2019 world championship fourth place finisher Bo Candalita Bere, and World University Games silver medalist Torben Bletch will be taking part. Oh, Spectators can watch the action unfold right in front of them, or if they prefer, on the big cinema screen. Naturally, protective measures will be observed. A pole vault competition at a drive in movie theater. What's not to like? The pole vault has never gotten more attention. If we're doing it at winners and losers of the sports lockdown, pole vault is a winner. It's gotten more attention than it's ever gotten in the last three months, just simply off of, I guess, its accessibility or your ability to do this with, uh, with you know, social distancing, I guess. What do I think of this? I mean, yeah, this is a commitment. I know Germany has been able to open a bit because of the, 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 you know, the good measures they took in the wake of the, the beginning of the outbreak. Uh, th- but uh, I don't know what my reaction is to this other than, I, I don't know, good on them for trying to catch on to the pole vault trend that's currently going on with these garden clashes. But now we have a drive-in clash. Uh, do you get like, does a bellhop <laughs> with a mask and gloves come to your car with rollerblades and take your order? Like, it seems like it's like 1950 track and field. You turn the radio on to listen. Just as yeah. Pole Vault is able to succeed during this time, so are drive-in movie theaters. Mm-hmm. I've been reading Making about that comeback. just in general. They've been able to make a comeback here. So you have the um, the marriage of two things that are able to function during a global pandemic. 